누가 선주가? 브로콜리 is said to be one of the most powerful veggie, which can help our body in preventing and can decrease the risk of prostate cancer, colon cancer, breast cancer, bladder cancer, and ovarian cancer. Now the question is how much broccoli is required by our body for preventing cancer. It is said that half cup of broccoli, that is 22 calories per day is sufficient, but for people who consume two cup of broccoli, twice a week may also meet the minimum requirement. The minimum recommendation for cruciferous vegetables is 3 to 4 cup per day, and this intake is not only from broccoli, but from all other cruciferous veggies. The primary anti-inflammatory isothiocyanates, provided by broccoli is sulforaphane, which is said to inactivate the nf kappa b pathway. nf kappa b is a molecule signaling device, which can rev up our inflammatory response, and increase production of inflammatory components, for example, IL-6, IL-1-beta, TNF-alpha, INOS and COX-2, for healing body injury. This process is good for short-term circumstances but when it continues indefinitely at a constant pace, can put the human body in serious health problems, and may lead to development of cancer. The sulforaphane anti-inflammatory isothiocyanates can inactivate, and shut down the nf kappa b pathway, and other components of the inflammatory system, and can prevent cancer from developing. Sulforaphane exists in cruciferous veggies like cabbage, cauliflower, Brussels sprouts, etc. in its food-bound form, known as glucoraphanin, a glycoside, bound to a sugar. Sulforaphane is a compound of the isothiocyanates group, and is produced when the enzyme myrosinase transforms glucoraphanin into sulforaphane, upon chewing while eating which allows the two compounds to mix and react. To get the maximum benefit of sulforaphane, one should eat the young sprouts of broccoli, and cauliflower particularly. The omega-3 fat in broccoli also play an important role, in balancing our inflammatory system activity. Of course we cannot simply depend on broccoli, as our sole source of anti-inflammatory isothiocyanates intake, but still broccoli is one of the best veggie available on earth. Broccoli is also a rich source of phytonutrient, like chemferol, and quercetin, which has the ability to lower the risk of chronic inflammation. Some other health benefits of broccoli are, good for skin, cures constipation, good for the heart, regulate blood pressure, excellent remedy against anemia, protects our eyes against macular degeneration, and cataracts, good for bone health and lastly boost immunity, which can protect the human body from cancer, and numerous infections.